Tonight, we look at women in football. For those who still think the football field is strictly a male domain, think again. Ready, let's go, let's go, let's go, ladies. Who's going to win? We are! Each spring in Key West, Florida, the world's best teams compete in the International Women's Flag Football Association Championship Tournament. Let's line up, ladies. Five on the 30, three in the back. Flag football, well, it's very intense. First set of play offense. It's going to be an I formation, sweep right. You sure you want to do it from a shotgun? Oh, well, a bunch of girls from Key Largo got together and decided to play football. I, now I understand what those guys go through out there. We have little flags hanging from us. This is a tough game for girls. Come on, get up there. All right, defense, do it. There's no protective gear because technically tackling is illegal, but that doesn't mean the on-field behavior is ladylike. But just yeah. good hard hitting. All right, they're football players. That's simple. We've got some great athletes out here. Some women who have unbelievable arms. And hey, it's a hard sport. There's hitting out there. You can't say, oh, I'm sorry, I hit you. Okay. Come on, Take it easy, you girls. This is just a fun game. Game is about field position, ladies. You gotta get down the field when it's hit. I could be aggressive and a bitch and know about sports, and I fit right in with the guys. She doesn't need a penny. Defense does not need pennies. Call out who you have. Go, Bernie! Go, Bernie! Go, go! Get down there, all right? Stay in your lane. Get down there. Come on, come on, come on! Since its inception, the IWFFA has vigorously supported squads from the USA and overseas. Through clinics and competition, they have worked to improve the quality of women's football. The results seen on the Key West playing fields speak for themselves. Each year, more and more teams participate the skill level improves. The players grow bigger and faster. The hitting gets harder. But even amidst the heat of battle, lifetime bonds are formed among rivals, fellow teammates, and even family members. Yeah, we do things together. And it's amazing that this little game of flag football has done this. I'm a single parent. I've been a single parent of her for 19 years. She doesn't live at home anymore, so now I see her more than I did when she lived at home. Because we hang out together all the time. So you would recommend this for other mother oh yeah. oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's brought us together immensely. She's 19, and we haven't done anything together Sorry. her whole life, really, until we got into this football team. And these are football teams. Eavesdrop on their sidelines, and you'll hear strategy that sounds exactly like their male counterparts. Hold her there and pass her off to the center. They okay. got one coming up the middle, she hits and releases, and then I've got the air corner coming. Corner comes hard? Yeah. Now you'll have me to pick that okay. up. The problem is, we're double sliding on that side. Someone's going to sneak in on your left side, you're not going to see him behind you. I'll just roll out strong side. I'm not seeing it in okay. the pocket. And That's get fine, because you can beat her. The on the next play, when you ran and you ran that sweep, run the sweep again, except toss it, because when you drug your ends across, they sucked up worried about you running. They were open. Once she passes that first line, there's nobody back there. No. Nobody. nobody after the front line. There's no linebackers. Linebackers. All we have now. to do is beat that front line and we're okay. gone. Okay. 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 And just like men's football, better X's and O's and better players usually spells victory. They're exceptional athletes. I really find that, for example, the St. Louis team has been down here for like five years and they've won it three years in a row. They're so poised, and the quarterback is such an excellent passer. You know, it's just, it's just unbelievable to see how accurate they are. I feel like, you know, there's no difference. The IWFFA is no different from any other sports league boasting its share of star players. 
But even the very best performers are not perfect and occasionally discover that football can be a very humbling game. For players who also coach, some afternoons can define the essence of Murphy's Law. <laughs> Look at this, she's got so much time to throw. Where's that defensive line? Hey, defensive line, come on, man, be sneaky. You guys can move around. And this was the team that we were gonna be. <laughs> Even on those days when the team is playing well, it's hard to keep track of everything, including the most fundamental piece of equipment in the women's game. Give me a flag. God, I felt like this mic was my flags. Completely forgot I didn't have them. But there are accessories that don't belong in the huddle. You gotta get the jerseys out. You wanna just sub somebody in? Yeah, sub it. Get someone in here. Hey, Cinda! Cinda, come here! With the proper attire Zach! and some scrambling yeah. ability, all things are possible. Keep going, Michelle! As with any football team, leadership can win a lot of games. Just ask lawyer turned coach Lynn Lewis. I think it's, it's absolutely possible that a woman could get the respect and has the knowledge to coach a college team. Maybe someday go into the pros. Anything's possible. Okay, ladies, the kicking team, you gotta be ready. Ladies, the kicking team. You cannot sit there and wait for them to come to you. Jenny! Switch with Bird. Bird, your nose tackle. Jenny, Jenny, listen, you guys. There's no reason to argue in the huddle. Get a huddle going. Diane, you're not a safety. Diane, move up. Diane! I'm from Brooklyn, so we say, okay, go to the hydrant or go to the stoop or the end of the car fender and make a left. Now we have designed plays. We have playbooks, and people have to study them in order to start on the team. Flag football, although it's supposed to not to be tackle or rough, it's pretty rough, and you're in good shape. But I think that it's great for everyone to know that football could be a women's sport. Competitive aggressive, not nasty aggressive. We don't show it in your face, no spiking, no dancing. Don't do that, Lori! That's not acceptable. Okay? We don't do that. But we don't do that on, on our team, okay? And you're on our team. So let's go. Good catch, but nothing like that. For us, the United States, there's a lot of women's teams. I think that it's because every other sport, there's women in it, and now we've got football. And, and I think that people see, hey, this is a team thing. We could use every part of our athletic ability and intelligence. You have to be smart to play football. You have to know the plays. And you have to be in shape. And all those things combined make football unique. And women want to be a part of that. And the world is changing. Women have a place everywhere. And maybe the perception that it's just a male-dominated sport will go away. And I think that's good for society.